Hi, this is Andrea for Beta Holic, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to use these coil cord ends. Now, these guys have been around forever, and there's a good reason for that. I'm going to use these on some three millimeter rat tail, and I've got some pretty purple rat tail. I'm just going to cut off a small amount for right now to demonstrate. Now besides the scissors and the, the cord and the cord ends, you're also going to need some chain nose pliers. And I recommend the fine chain nose pliers for this application um, because they grab onto that last coil more securely. And I like to use, you're going to need some kind of adhesive. I use this E6000, this is the best stuff and I've got a little piece of scrap wire to apply the E6000. So you want to make sure your cord end is fairly uh, together and not frayed. I'm just going to take a little tiny bit of the E6000. I can either try to apply it to the end of the cord or I'm going to put a little bit on my wire and just kind of spread it on the inside of the cord end. And I'm simply going to insert my cord end into the coil, like so. I'm going to take my fine chain nose pliers and I'm going to just grab that last coil there. I'm going to slowly begin squeezing it in until you can tell that it is pinching the actual cord. Now even without the glue you can tell this isn't going anywhere but the glue will add an extra bit of security for you. And there you have it. That's a great way to end um, a cord necklace that you've made or bracelet. You just add a jump ring and a clasp to this and you're all set to go. Thanks for watching.